Hi there, it's Sandy Cohen, and we're going to look at some of the ways that you can work with automatic numbered lists. Let's start at the beginning. Right now I've got some text and it doesn't have a number, and I'd like to have each one of these paragraphs numbered with the correct number. Well, rather than go in and number these by hand, all I have to do is click up here at the control panel and you'll see something that says numbered list. I'm going to click and there you go. I've got a numbered list. So what's so special about using this electronic or automatic numbered list? Well, here's the good part. Let's say I want Adam's pearmain to be just before early red flesh. I'm going to select this paragraph four clicks. I'm going to cut it and then I'm going to click right in front of early red flesh. Now I can't click in front of that three. That's because it's electronic. It's built into the paragraph. But I do click in front of the text and then I choose paste. And there's Adam's pearmain. Now, what's wonderful about what had just happened was that the numbers renumber. So, if I take early red flesh and cut it and go in front of Adenac and paste, again, the numbers renumber. I wouldn't be able to do that if I had hand numbered or manually numbered my paragraphs, I'd have to go in and renumber them. So that's one of the benefits of using the automatic numbering. But there's another benefit that's even more important. I'm going to select all, this, all these paragraphs, and then I'm going to option click or alt click on the numbered list options. And you'll see here it says bullets and numbering, and the format is one, two, three, four. Down here where it says number, I've got some code. And the code is caret number sign period tab. And what that simply means is that each one of these numbers has a period after it. Well, I'm going to get rid of that period just delete it from the code, and then I'm going to go shift parenthesis. And let's see if I click preview here, you can see that I've changed the format. I can also keep the code for just the number and the tab. I can even do my favorite numbering format, which is before the caret number sign, I put an actual number sign. Press the tab, and you can see now I have number one, number two, number three. So this gives me some formatting options that I really wouldn't have been able to work with had I typed all this in myself.